If you really want to make a lasting impression on your date, do something special before you're even asked. Hi everyone, it's Patty from Executive Search Dating, Vancouver's number one personalized matchmaking service. Today's subject is five things your date wants you to do without having to ask. You know, making a great first impression on your date doesn't have to be dramatic or spectacular. It can even be something very simple. But timing is everything. The same gesture that falls flat at the end of the date might have made a huge positive impact at the beginning of the date. So here's five things your date wants you to do without having to ask. Number one, manners matter. If you're looking for something serious, you want someone who knows how to act. And that goes for your date too. Holding their chair, taking their coat, pouring them some water. Sometimes it's the simplest gestures that make the biggest impact. Number two, listen. It's easy to think that you need to do most of the talking on a date, particularly if you're nervous. In fact, the reverse is true. Listen more than you talk and try building on subjects that your date finds interesting. Pretty soon, they'll find you interesting too. Number three, be kind. Being kind to your date is one thing you definitely have to do, uh, but you can also ruin a date by being rude to others. The taxi driver, the wait staff, or the couple sitting next to you. Being rude to others sends the message to your date that you may be rude to them at some point in the future too. Number four, stay away from toxic topics. If you've just met someone, you want to keep your date positive. Avoid talking politics or past relationships or even work stress. Good dates should feel like an oasis from the troubles, away from the troubles of the day. Number five, be focused. Don't let your gaze drift away. It sends the message that you're not really into your date and probably not true relationship material for them. Focus on your date, even if you don't feel amazing chemistry. Who knows, if you leave them with a positive impression, they may know, they may know someone who's a great fit for you. There you have it, everyone. I hope you found that helpful and useful, and I hope you're having a great day, and we'll look forward to talking to you again real soon. Take care.